Hey everybody, BrickLover18 here today with day number four, three or four of the LEGO renovation. I think it's day number three now that I mention it, but who knows. So today I've actually done a lot of changes. As you can see, I've gotten quite a bit of the LEGO out of the room. This is where <laughs> part of my city that actually just fell over a couple minutes ago. It fell off and I just haven't cleaned it up yet. I don't have time. Um, yeah. You know, there's the old desk. There's this part. The main thing that the, the only really important thing in this video is, ta-da! Here are all my new shelving units. So shelves on two sides. I'm standing in the corner right now so I can give you a better view in a minute. Each side has about four shelves. This side has three, but will have four. As you can see, there's two little brackets here in this opening. That's gonna be bins, actually, but there are shelves there for more sets. But like then nothing's obviously permanent here. Ooh, sorry, I almost fell. I'm tripping on my camera cord. Nothing's permanent. Just got everything here. And then we'll just quickly zoom over to this side. And we have even more shelves. Just crazy. They're just loaded up right now just so I can have time to get the tables in. So basically we went to Home Depot a couple days ago on a Tuesday. This is Thursday. Got the wood. My dad already had all the brackets and stuff. And we're ready to go. So, I'll get the measurements wrong, I know it. So I think, I believe these are 12 inch brackets right here on these bottom shelves, and they look really good. These ones are 12 inch brackets as well, but they're a bit different. And these ones are 16 inch brackets, and they hang over. Well, the thing is, my dad got these on sale a couple of years ago for only $1.50 a bracket, which still seems like a lot of brackets, because in this room I need 30 brackets. So they, they got them for $1.50. Well, it, to upgrade all the brackets, because I only have five of the 12 inch brackets to make the whole room work, as you can see, all the big ones on this side, in order to get upgraded all, they're gonna be $4.30 about a bracket. If you can't do the math, or don't wanna do the math, that is 30, or no, that is $130 in little pieces of metal right here just to hold shelves up so what we're gonna end up doing is we're just gonna cut these down to size because as my dad mentioned like you know that's 130 dollars and you know we can spend it if we want but that just seems like a huge tremendous waste of money and i agree like 130 dollars for something you're not gonna see so we're just gonna cut it and as he said you know by the time we cut them down and you put all your lego on the shelves nobody's even gonna walk in the room and say hey those brackets aren't the same so i agree there the tables are still going here, all along here. The city table here, a lot wider. And the table here. The table, you know, is going to be about this height all the way around. So that's very exciting. I'm going to run out of space on this memory card, apparently, in a minute. So that's just what my plan is. My review studio is still going to go here. Got to finish that up. And here, the light, to address the lighting problem, I'm actually going to make fluorescent lights here. So take out this whole light fixture and put an outlet into the ceiling. And going to have wall outlets right here. I'm going to go now, leave it at that because I'm going to run out of space any minute now. Thanks a lot for watching. Stay tuned for day number four, day number five, depending on what this video is, for more LEGO renovation updates. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a great day.